Fetal tissue engineering is a therapeutic concept. It involves several steps. Once a diagnosed is made of a birth defect with fetal imaging, we have nowadays a very precise set of uh, information that tells us the dimensions of the defect, the type of the defect, and what we expect once the baby is born. So what we do is we collect fetal cells, which can be obtained from different sources, and with these cells we engineer one or more types of tissue in parallel to the remainder of gestation so that when the baby is born he or she will have tissue promptly available for the repair of the defect, the right size, right shape, etc. Uh, because the tissue is made with the baby's own cells there's no risk of rejection. As far as the birth defects that can be treated with this principle, there's a myriad of them. Uh, just to name a few, congenital diaphragmatic hernia, airway defects, chest wall defects, limb defects, facial defects, urinary tract defects are just some of them that can be treated this way. But in principle, anytime you can engineer a tissue to repair, surgically repair an anomaly, and if there is any benefit uh, to the use of such tissue, this uh, idea can be in principle applied to almost every type of congenital defect that demands a surgical repair. As far as ethical concerns, so far there's been none. The reason being we are not creating any cell. We are not cloning anything, we're not making anything. These cells are already there, uh, either in the amniotic fluid or other sources. Moreover, they're being used to help the baby, meaning he or she will get cells or tissue made with his or her own cells. So, so far there's been no ethical objection whatsoever.